When finding slant asymptotes, sometimes referred to as oblique asymptotes, one has to concern themselves with the degree of the numerator and denominator in a similar manner that you have to uh, do when finding horizontal asymptotes. Slant asymptotes occur in one specific situation. They only occur in functions where the degree of the numerator is exactly one greater than the degree of the denominator. For example, in the function f of x equals 3x squared plus 2 over x minus 1, the degree of the numerator is 2 and the degree of the denominator is 1. The degree of the top is 1 greater than the degree in the bottom, so there is a slant asymptote. To find the slant asymptote, we have to do a division. We're going to divide the numerator, 3x squared plus 2, by the denominator, x minus 1. And in this situation, we can divide using synthetic division. Synthetic division is a process where you take uh, what you're dividing by, in this case, x minus 1, set it equal to 0, and find that x equals 1, and put that in a box, and then across the top row, write the coefficients of what you're dividing. The coefficient on x squared is 3. There's not an x to the first term, so you put a coefficient of 2 to represent the x to the first term, or a coefficient of 0 to represent the x to the first term, and the constant is a 2. And then when performing the synthetic division, you bring the first number down unchanged and then take 1, what's in the box, times 3 to get a 3. And then as you go down the columns, you add positive 0 and positive, or 0 and positive 3 make 3. 1 times 3 is 3, and 2 and 3 is 5. So this quotient can be represented as 3x, the, the, the first number 3 comes from the first number in the bottom row, plus 3, second 3 is represented right there, and the last number is the remainder, which is written over what you are dividing by originally. So this quotient is 3x plus 3 plus 5, over x minus 1. The slant asymptote, the equation of the slant asymptote can be found here. y equals 3x plus 3 is the equation of the slant asymptote. If we look at the graph of this function, this line, this dotted line, would have, an, have the equation y equals 3x plus 3. And as this graph moved towards infinity, and towards the right, towards positive infinity, it would be getting closer and closer to y equals 3x plus 3. And to negative infinity, it would also be getting closer and closer to y equals 3x plus 3.